Hi everyone, it's Pleasance from Little Ohm, and here is a little inspiring strength video for you for your movement practices, right? So we're balancing throughout our thriving practices all the different way that we can move, ways that we can move our body. So let's do some strength work. So here's a kettlebell. I got this at Marshall's, it's probably five bucks. There's lots of awesome ways to use kettlebells. Let me show you one way that you can um, do it at home. So take your legs wider than hip distance, drop that kettlebell down, bend your knees, and then you give a nice swing up and down. Now I'm using my arms, I'm using my legs, I'm breathing, I could put on some good music and do like 12 reps two or three times. That's one way that you can use strength <laughs> the other way, or another way, is these are just two pound weights. Again, <coughs> Marshalls, TJ Maxx, whatever. I always see these weights there. So you can grab a set and you can do any of your standing poses using weights. So this has two pounds, so that's about four pounds. So it's really not that much. You might find when you're doing little movements like this, that over time, if you breathe with it, that it actually does, you can feel your muscles really um, working. There's a lot of sensation. Inhale and exhale. So you can also do this um, into your warrior goddesses, right? So your toes are out and uh, your heels are in. You can lift your arms and bend and extend and work some strength training just a little bit more with a little bit of weights. You could obviously go much heavier with these, but these are the ones I just had laying around, so I grabbed those to show you. Now, <clears throat> let's say you don't have any traditional weights to add into your movement practice. <clears throat> you could easily grab, if you have a bolster around, or a pillow cushion from your couch uh, or chair. We use these a lot before I had weights just hugging, holding it in, and then bend and extend, and you can even lift up and down and up and down. So just kind of adding some more weight into your practice, into your movement, a few times a week will be great for your muscles. Last one I wanted to show you <laughs> was using the block as well. So when we're doing strength practice, um, I really would like for you, in fact, I'm gonna grab another block, um, to, I'd love for you to be incorporating the little yoga push-ups. And so here we've got our two blocks. We're gonna look forward, bend, lift, and lower. Just nice and gentle. You're gonna feel the muscles really start to shake. You can also do this just on your toes, up and down, and then press back. So hopefully these are some ways that you can add strength into your practice. Email me, let me know what you're doing for strength, weightlifting, adding extra push-ups, or just building strength with your home practice if you can't get to a gym regularly um, for whatever reason. So thanks so much, namaste.